What's up, you guys? This is Karmic Endings 1010, where we talk about karmic situations that could be going on in your life at this time that you need to be aware of, or this could just be confirmation that you made the right decision or you're currently making the right decision. Archangel, spirit guides, ancestors of my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel this current karmic energy for the collective. Please give me clear and accurate messages. Thank you guys for all the likes, the shares, the comments, the subscribes, the emails, the bookings, the donations. I appreciate you guys for all of the love and the support you show to me and the channel. I appreciate you. Definitely appreciate you guys. All right. So let's see what's going on with the energy. Man abuse. Just sex, nothing more. Let's get one more. One more spirit. Gutter mouth. And we have tag team assisting to up the hate. So this could have something to do with someone that's hurting a masculine. Okay? Someone is hurting a masculine energy here. Okay? This could be a, a gutter mouth asshole. Alright? So we about to get into the energy and see what's going on. So this could be somebody, this person could be bad, um, getting together with people to try to bad mouth somebody or something like that. Or this could be somebody, this could be also a masculine playing the victim and lying and saying something about somebody. That's also what I'm feeling. So we're going to get into the energy and see what's going on. All right. What's going on spirit with this current energy? Okay, six of pentacles, five of cups, the temperance, king of cups. So for some, somebody could have gave to somebody and they could be sad about it. But somebody is trying to be patient in a situation about something. Let's see. Let's keep on spirit. King of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles. Eight of Wands. So this is giving me an energy where somebody could be upset or blaming somebody about a situation and saying that somebody could have teamed up against them to get something done. Okay, that's also what I'm hearing. Somebody could feel like somebody breadcrumbed them and they could be very sad about this about somebody breadcrumbing them and maybe this person could be spreading lies about somebody. Okay, so somebody may not be fucking with somebody really like that or they're not really fucking with somebody no more and somebody could be sad about the situation. But somebody could feel like somebody is their soulmate or something like that. But they could be blaming this person, saying that this person did something to them or something like that. And this person could have got other people involved, even, you know, to about that. Or this could have something to do, like I said, the, with the first situation, the masculine getting abused. So this could be a masculine that may not be fucking with somebody really no more okay and whoever this person are fucking with they don't they feel lost because they could feel like somebody is really their soulmate you know what i'm saying but somebody want to be single and they really rejecting somebody so somebody is like i want to be single and they rejecting somebody and this person got mad and started teaming up with other motherfuckers to come against this masculine Okay. Yeah, somebody was trying to get pregnant by somebody too. Yep, Ten of Cups. Yeah, this could have been has something to do with a family situation. Yep. King uh Queen of Cups. 
Yeah, because what I'm seeing is that's what I'm seeing. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio is strong. Okay. Well, yeah, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, but strong Cancer and Pisces. Strong Taurus. We got Sagittarius and Virgo. Yep. Somebody is teaming up with other people to try to get somebody fucked up because somebody is rejecting them. Or some like or some kind of way. This could be legally or this could be like somebody actually trying to set somebody up like for somebody to get hurt. Okay. Just because somebody is rejecting them. Clarify six of pentacles. Oh, let me make sure ain't no cards. What's in the one? Clarify six of pentacles. Hey man. Yeah, somebody could have somebody is paying for somebody to get sacrificed. Bottom of the deck, five of swords. I'm telling y'all. Somebody is paying for somebody to get sacrificed because they emotionally walking away from them. Somebody don't like that shit. Somebody knows somebody emotionally walking away from them and going to a new love that they know that they're going to invest in. And somebody is really trying to cause a lot of like chaos, conflict, burdens before this two of cups could come into play. Yep. Yeah. Yo, somebody is paying for somebody to get sacrificed, yo. That's what I'm straight what I'm seeing because somebody could feel like they lost. Somebody is not accepting loss. Somebody is not able to like to accept losing. Yep, somebody is like not, they're not willing to accept that. It's like somebody is like, no, what do you mean? Like. Yo, and this could have been somebody that was abusing somebody for a while too, but somebody could be like upset because somebody, they not giving to them really no more like they used to. And somebody know that it's, it's over with, you know, somebody, you know, you, you know, you know what I'm saying? You know, when you in a relationship with somebody, you know, you know, when things start to you know, apart. You know what I'm saying? You can feel it within within the energy. You know, you can feel it. Clarify five of cups. Knight of swords. Yeah, somebody sad as hell. Now they want to come attack you. Hell yeah, they want to come attack your ass. Hell yeah, sneaking though. So this is a sneaky asshole. This is somebody that's trying to sneak and do some shit. Okay, yeah, this person trying to investigate where you live so they could pop up at your house. Yeah, this person's trying to pop up at your house when you don't expect it and shit. So this person could be trying to investigate like where you live. So they could do a pop up. This person trying to sneak you. Okay. Y'all, what the fuck? Clarify temperance. Temperance clarifying temperance. So y'all got, hell yeah. Okay. Ten of Wands at the bottom. Okay, so y'all have two powerful, I'm just feeling like this is this energy. You have two powerful angels, beings around you right now that's really blocking this person. Okay, because this person is in a Ten of Wands with trying to get to you or, or something like that. But for a lot of you guys, you got two powerful angels that's covering you. Yep. You got two powerful angels that's covering you. Hell yeah. These are your ancestors. Very powerful ancestors. I, I have to add that, okay, with the magician. So it's making this person roll hard when it comes to, like, trying to get to you. Yup, you got two powerful angels, yo. They powerful as fuck. 
is what I'm feeling. These beings is powerful. And they able to control a lot of shit. You know what I'm saying? So this person, this person, <laughs> this is some like almost some supernatural shit. <laughs> I'm just picking this up. Okay, because angelic protection is real. Like beings that protect you, that's real. Like people don't understand that shit. That shit is real. And it's like, this person may not even understand why it's so hard to, to get certain information from you. But certain stuff may not be popping up. For some of y'all, it could be old shit popping up. So, like, this person could be getting information, but it could be old shit for some of y'all. You know, it may not even be nothing nothing new, okay? Um, This person could be picking up on wrong shit. Yep, this person is getting rejected. And this person, for some of y'all, this person that you ain't don't like, you will be some man, I'm telling you. People, a lot of people cannot handle rejection. Like it takes them to another in their head. It's just something that snaps off. You know what I mean? Some people be like, well, that just seemed too extreme. Like you just listen. I'm trying to tell you, I haven't seen it with my own two eyes. When it comes to rejection, some people just cannot handle it on an emotional, mental level. They cannot handle it. Like, rejection is almost like a death to them. Like, you know what I mean? So, it's like sometimes people mentally check out and go some, you know, they mentally check out. You know? Clarify King of Cups. Clarify this King of Cups. Hell yeah. Queen of Swords reverse. That's that's one of them. Where that card that feel? Hold up, y'all. Hell yeah. Eight of Cups. Ace of Swords. So for some of y'all, this could have been somebody that this person could have recruited. So this could have been a situation where somebody could have went to this person and said, okay, well, I need you to help me to get this done. Boom, 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 boom. So for some of y'all, this could have been a King of Cups energy. This was one of the person that was, you know, involved in maybe setting somebody up. This person could have found out somebody was lying about something and this person could have backed out. Because this person could have found out some clarity about the whole situation and was like, you know what, I ain't doing this shit. You, mother you motherfucking lying about that information you gave me. That, that information wasn't right. You know what I'm saying? So somebody is disappointed. They emotionally walked away like, you know, I ain't fucking with this. You know what I'm saying? Clarify King of Pentacles. Clarify King of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles, Nine of Swords. Five of Wands. Yeah, it's a lot of commotion going on with this whole setup. It's a lot of commotion going on. It's a lot of money on the line, though. But it's a lot of, like, commotion and bullshit going on. You got people backing up. You got somebody else that's, um, like, worried about how things is going to go. Okay, clarify this Nine of Pentacles. All right. So we got King of Cups. We got Empress. And we got Ace of Cups. So, all of this is going on because somebody is in love with someone else. That's why all of this is going on. Somebody is in love with someone and somebody cannot take somebody walking away from them. Okay? And somebody is making it terribly hard for somebody to do that. And whatever that this person try to do to somebody, it's like they, you know, they be refusing shit. It's like somebody, they just be, that all they do is fantasize about the person that they be, they really want to be with. Or something like that is what I'm hearing. Because this is somebody that's in something where they in a process of walking away from something. 
And whoever this person is that's in somebody's energy, this person um, could have had somebody with them for a long time, for years. I'm seeing 14 years. Somebody could have been. Okay, you could flip the energy also, y'all. This could be male, female, whatever. Just flip it how you see. But somebody is in love with somebody and they don't they can't take somebody leaving them so they trying to like put a bunch of blocks up in between somebody and shit like that okay i just gotta let you know what i'm seeing y'all so for some of y'all this could be a past situation so this could be like confirmation that this was a karmic situation that you went through this was a karmic lesson that you went through Okay, clarify four of cups. Death card. Yeah, somebody is rejecting somebody because it's a total ending. Somebody has already, listen, three of cups. Somebody has already rejected somebody, but somebody keeps trying to offer somebody shit. Somebody could have even tried to offer somebody a threesome. But the threesome was set up for somebody to get, for somebody to, so this is how it was going to be. Somebody was going to set up a threesome, but when they set up the threesome, they was going to get somebody jumped in the process and try to get somebody hurt or something like that. Probably even try to kill somebody. So somebody was going to try to use a threesome to, so something could end for them. This could also be like an STD. Somebody could be high and that they could have contracted this during like the separation or whatever. Somebody could be holding this back and then they get somebody in a threesome and then somebody contract this kind of uh, STD. And that person know if they get into that, that it will close the cycle when it came to like getting back with anybody. This person know that. So this person is trying to get somebody caught up in a threesome so somebody could get an STD that they're going to have to pass away with. So something could be ended. Is what I'm seeing here. So it's almost like this person is trying every which way. So for some of y'all, certain ways it did not work. For some people, something did work. The, the STD one worked. But for some people, this person even bypassed this STD. So now this person is thinking about, okay, I got to pay to get you killed or sacrificed, whatever, however you want to say it. Okay, somebody is now getting into that because it's like, okay, I can't even, I can't get this person to sleep with me. I can't get this person to do a threesome with me. So I'm about to set this person up to get taken the fuck out of here. Period. For some of them, they could have life insurance policies, okay? So they know if this person passed away that they'd get a lot of money, all right? So they already know that. So somebody could be setting that up, but I'm seeing one person back out, though. Somebody, this person, somebody, um, Pisces, Cancer, Aquarius, that person is backing out. Because somebody is like, well, you told, you ain't even tell me the truth. Or somebody found out some kind of clarity and was like, I ain't, man, I ain't fucking with that shit. Or something like that. It's just a lot of commotion with people wanting to back out and all kind of shit. It's a lot of commotion going on. All because somebody is in love with somebody else. Miscarriage. Yeah, this person... <clears throat> excuse me this person could have tried to have a baby with somebody and they had a miscarriage or they got an abortion or something like that it's like nothing for some people nothing that they doing is working like that we have boat or a yacht somebody could have a bald head current energy Current energy. Current energy. 
current energy. Black socks. Something to do with black socks could be significant. We have colorful hair. Somebody could have a big butt. That water sign a hater, Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. Right leg and or thigh tattoos. We have S. Somebody could love scary movies. We have Q. I. We have B. Briefs. Somebody could be real thin, real small. Something to do with a flight. We have hood. Rings. High class. SUV. Right arm tattoos. We have X. Trainer or trainee. We have K. Fake emperor. Okay. So for some of y'all, like I said, this could be a situation where somebody could be trying to play the play the blame game. Okay, when it comes to you. And this person could have people set up to try to come after you. Okay, so this person could be playing a blame game in a situation for some of y'all. Okay, this could be a person that you could have rejected and this person is not taking rejection well. Okay, and this could be a fake emperor that is like, okay, you're going to reject me. Okay, well, I'm going to set your ass up. Kind of energy. All right. Then let's. We have S. A succubus female. So this person, so if this is a fake emperor, this person could have had a female on their team to help come up against you. So for some of y'all, this is your baby daddy. This person had a succubus female to come with them to try to come up against you. To try to get you set up, to try to get you taken out of here. All right. Factory worker. Single. Nike. Somebody love wearing buns in their hair. We have drunk. All right, so two. Some about Aquarius could be significant. All right, Pisces, 23 or 32. We have 80s. We have nurse. We have H. Mental health issues. Short curly hair. We have dogs, actor, actress, singer, engaged, that air sign of hater, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. We have freckles, body sprays, 20s, club employee. All right. All right, so y'all. So this fake emperor, this fake emperor and this other person, this is what they got, okay? Coming coming towards you with the bullshit. And that's, that's what the fuck they got going on, okay? Yo. Something with Kevin. I just heard that. Okay. Somebody could have been born in March or February. Somebody could be a life path number three or life path number three. I mean, a life path number two or a life path number three. Something with Sharita. Something with Shannon. Okay. Okay. What else? Something with Carissa. All right, something with Sherry, okay? Something with Ronald. Something with Victor. Something with Vanessa. Okay? Something with Rick. I'm hearing Rick. Okay? Something with Isaac. Isaac. Okay. Something with Ohio. Something with Illinois. 
okay? Something with burner, burner. I just heard burner. Something with Quentin or Quantrell. All right. All right, you guys, I'm going to leave it there. Like, comment, and subscribe. Okay, I just heard something. So somebody could play an instrument. What's that instrument called? Um, let me think. Oh, boy. What is that instrument called? Somebody play this instrument. And I, I see the instrument in my head, but I it's like the name. I can't get the name. And I see it in my head, too. I wish I could just take it out and show y'all the picture. <laughs> but somebody play some kind of instrument. It's like it's like okay, so you hold the instrument and it's shaped like it's like a like like that. Like it's it's shaped like like <laughs> whatever. I don't know. Yeah, I would just leave just erase that out your mind. Just like <laughs> saxophone. Okay, thank you, spirit. Okay, I just heard. Okay, saxophone. Okay. <laughs> I was trying to like think like what the fuck? What is that? Saxophone. Okay. All right. All right, you guys. Okay. Also I'm hearing somebody could be like a somebody could have a junior. So somebody could be a senior. And somebody could have a junior or something like that. Okay. All right, you guys, like, comment, and subscribe. I'm hearing something about Carter. Carter, like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below for any other information about me. And until next time, peace.